everyone welcome back to my youtube channel and welcome to a new in haul so i've got a little collection of pieces that i've been purchasing or have been very kindly gifted over the last few weeks and i thought i'd pop them all together into one haul for you i really love these pieces um they're getting slightly more spring appropriate which is very exciting we've got some really nice neutral spring colors in here so i'm really excited to show you the haul but first of all i have a little jewelry unboxing for you guys you know how much I love my jewellery. I've got none on at the moment, so I'm going to unbox these pieces from PD Paula and we can put them on together. So this is a brand that I've loved for quite a long time now. I think I first heard about them maybe like a year ago. They're a Barcelona-based jewellery brand and they have such beautiful, unique pieces. <clears throat> Excuse me of such high quality and really affordable price points as well. I love my jewellery to be special, but also wearable to be able to wear every day and they have some stunning pieces. I also very excitingly have a discount code for you guys. So if you wanna get some money off, you can use my discount code. It's amybeth15, all in capitals. I'll pop it on the screen for you and I'll leave all the information along with all the links from this video in the description box for you. I absolutely adore the packaging as well. How cute these little bags so the first thing i have to show you guys is this beautiful initial necklace now i'll show you it close up here i'll show you in the cutaway as well and i'll show it you on but how beautiful is this really simple thin gold chain with obviously my a initial and then it's surrounded by a little gold oval as well i think this is absolutely stunning i don't have an initial necklace or anything that's kind of like personal to me um, so I thought this would be such a lovely, lovely piece to have in my jewellery collection. Super dainty as well. You guys know I love dainty jewellery. So I'm going to pop this on now. And this is definitely something that would be kind of like an everyday wearable piece. Something that I probably wouldn't take off. You could easily layer it with something a bit longer or maybe a choker. But I just think this is absolutely stunning. So I have just popped the initial necklace on. I've got it on the slightly shorter setting but there is... A longer one as well but i adore this let me zoom in so you guys can see it better so this is one of pd powder's best selling pieces i absolutely adore it obviously i got it in an a but they have every single letter of the alphabet of course so you can choose whichever one you want it may be quite nice to get boyfriend's initial best friend's initial something like that but i just went for the a because i thought it was super cute i really feel like this piece looks so luxurious as well i also think this would be such a lovely idea for a gift we've got mother's day coming up if you know somebody who's got a birthday such a beautiful little pendant it literally goes with everything and is perfect for every day this is definitely going to be something that i'm going to keep on like i said i've got no other jewelry on at the moment so this is going to be my daily jewelry for today i also have some other beautiful bits that i cannot wait to show you guys so first up is this stunning ring hopefully the camera's going to focus there we go as you can see it's got kind of like a gap in the middle beautiful detail around the top part so stunning um, I absolutely love this. I thought this would be really good on my middle finger. So this is it on. So pretty, really dainty. Just that little bit different from like a normal gold band. Super special, I love this. And although this is tiny bit glitzy, I think it's so perfect for every day. It's really nice and subtle, really understated. Such a classic piece of jewelry. It looks beautiful on its own like this, but I think it would also be great for stacking as well. Love a good ring stack at the moment. And then I have another gorgeous ring. This one is a little bit more special. This one I probably wouldn't wear every day. It's for like maybe a special occasion, a bit more of like a statement ring. Um, this is what it looks like. So this is called the Dumbo ring. As you can see, it's almost like three layers in one ring. So it's really nice and thick. Definitely a statement. Really, really beautiful piece though. I cannot wait to wear this. I actually don't have much kind of like evening jewellery, but I think this will be so perfect for the evening. I can wear it on my middle finger, but I could also wear it on my index finger as well. Super comfortable. Also, I thought this may be a bit uncomfortable to wear, but it's really comfortable. I think both of these together are such lovely, lovely pieces and the quality is just amazing. And finally, we've got rings, we've got a necklace. I need some earrings, I think. So I picked up these and again, these are kind of a mixture between something I would wear every day, but also something that could be a little bit special. These are a really beautiful, subtle pair of hoop earrings. So these are called the King's Gold Hoops. 
and they're just so beautiful. A really classic shape and nice small style as well. But also the cubic zirconia on them just gives them that extra special touch perfect for the evening now because they are quite small i do think you could get away with wearing them during the day um i'm gonna pop them in now so i think they're beautiful oh good job i put my hair up for this video so you can see them properly i think these are absolutely stunning literally makes such a difference when you've got beautiful jewelry on it's transformed the way i look today yeah oh my goodness i absolutely love these again i'll just zoom in so you can see them better how beautiful are these the perfect size hoop for me. I don't like anything too big. I like something that's subtle, understated. That's exactly what these are. Also goes so nicely with this ring look. I'm really excited to wear these pieces. Um, I'm going out for dinner on Saturday, so I think they'll look so nice then. So those are my new in pieces from PD Paula. I really hope you guys enjoyed seeing them. Don't forget, you can get 15% off with my discount code amybeth15. Again, I'll pop it on the screen for you and all the info and all the links will be in the description box. So now you have seen my jewellery unboxing, I thought I would get on with the rest of the haul video for you guys. Now the first thing that I'm going to start with is something that I'm wearing and most of you have probably already spotted it. Um, I'll stand up so you can see it a bit better. I got this vest top from Loewe, obviously you can see the little logo on the front here. Uh, but I absolutely love this. This arrived in the post yesterday and obviously I've put it straight on today. Um, it's a little bit premature. It's still a bit too chilly for vest tops, but I really thought I would get my wear out of this in the spring and the summer this year. I wanted it last year and I bit the bullet um, last week and ordered it for myself. I got it direct from the Loewe website. I got it in a size small and it fits perfectly. I absolutely love it. Obviously I went for the white. I think they also do it in black and grey and I think they do crop versions as well but I got the longer one as I just thought that it would be more practical. I know that £250 is a lot of money to spend on a vest. I wear vest tops all the time. I wore them so much last year. I've already been wearing them and layering them up this year even though it's st still a bit chilly so I knew that I would definitely get my wear out of this so I'm very very excited to have it. I obviously have my Loewe belt and Loewe uh, basket bag as well so I'm really excited to mix all these things into my spring and summer wardrobe together. Next up I got some pieces from Anina Bing. Now you may have already seen this in in a vlog or maybe on my tiktok i can't remember but they sent me this gorgeous jumper it's one from the terry o'neill collection you may have seen them floating around before they do kate moss ones as well but obviously this one is elton john i absolutely love it super oversized because i got it in a size medium so it's nice and big uh, but i already have an anina bing light gray hoodie so i thought i'd go for like the darker charcoal gray in the sweatshirt style and i've worn this so much anina bing is one of my favorite brands such good quality really wearable pieces i just love them i can literally live in these i could wear this every single day when i'm at home i also from anina bing got a pair of jeans um i've never tried any jeans from there before um but i picked these ones from the website i think they're called black tie jeans um but they're just like a black kind of washed black straight leg cropped with a raw hem and i love these the fit of them is amazing i was a bit unsure on what size to go for whether i should size up or size down i went for a 27 which was my normal size and they fit really, really nicely. It's such a fab jean. I love the fact that they're cropped as well. So I think they'll be really, really good for spring. I wore them the other day with my Adidas Sambas and the Anina Bing jumper and a leather jacket. And it was just such a nice, like comfy, casual look. I also think that these jeans would look great dressed up in the evening, either with a pair of heels or my um, black stiletto boots, I think would look really nice with them and like a white shirt. Just such a fab piece. I do already have quite a few black jeans in my wardrobe, but none in this style. So I'm very happy with these. Next up, I have a piece from River Island, which is a brand that I don't normally shop at. I used to quite a bit when I was younger, but I haven't kind of revisited that for a while, but I picked up this skirt. It's one of those kind of like pencil style mid axi skirts, just plain black and long. Um, zip and button fastening at the top. Um, I wanted one of these for a really long time. I had one from Zara and this was just before Christmas and I didn't really think I was going to wear it so I returned it and then they became such a huge trend and sold out everywhere. So I managed to get my hands on this one from River Island. It keeps coming back into stock so definitely check. I ordered it and they only had a size 8 available so 
definitely keep an eye out because I'm sure it will be coming back. Like I said, I got it in a size 8. It fits really nicely. They also do it in cream as well, which I'm super tempted by. I think that would be so nice for spring. I've styled this a few ways actually. I've styled it quite casually with a bomber jacket and some chunky boots with my Samba trainers, my New Balance trainers. Also looks great with a heel and like I wore it with a black turtleneck long sleeve for the evening. So it's a really great piece and very on trend at the moment as well. Next I have some pieces from Pretty Lavish. I can't do a new in haul without including some pretty lavish pieces. The first one is definitely my favorite. So the thing that drew me towards this dress the most was the color. It's this beautiful sort of like taupe color, a really nice like brownie beige color, which I love. I also really love this kind of neckline. It's a little bit, little bit kind of one shouldered. Um, I think it's really nice and different. I love the material, super stretchy, really, really flattering as well. Um, and I love the length. So basically I love everything about this dress. Um, I've styled it with uh, my white Anina Bing coat and some cream boots or cream coat and cream boots. I love them both together. I think this color and the cream look so nice. Very, very spring. Um, I wear this dress in a size extra small and I've been showing it to you backwards the whole time. <laughs> it's this way. I always take an extra small in dresses in Pretty Lavish and they fit really, really nicely. This is so comfortable as well would be great for like a baby shower, a brunch, something like that. I see a lot of um, pregnant women wearing Pretty Lavish as well, so I presume it's comfortable for that. But yeah, I just love this dress, something a little bit different, and it screams spring. Also have a, <laughs> a jumper from Pretty Lavish. I adore this colour as well, it's such a nice beige. I'm definitely about all these like brighter neutral colours as we're coming into spring. How many times have I said spring in this video? So I got this in a size small. It's just a plain, nice knitted jumper, kind of cropped. Well, not too cropped, but not long. And then at the back, it's got a little bit of an open back and a tie, which is such a nice detail. This would look so great with a pair of boots and some blue denim for like a smart lunch or something. Would also look great, I think, with some leather trousers and a black blazer over the top. I just love the color. This is so cozy as well. I'm not quite ready to give up the knitwear just yet. And finally, from Pretty Lavish, I have a pair of cream slash off-white trousers. I've been after a pair of cream wide leg trousers for the longest time. I have a couple already, but I want the perfect fit. And you know what? These ones are up there. They're pretty darn close. Um, they're really nice, long, straight leg. Definitely need to give them a press. Um, they have pockets as well, which is lovely. They don't have belt loops, which is the only annoying thing. I would love to put um, like a tan leather belt with these in the summer, but unfortunately they don't have belt loops. I really do love the shape of these though. They're really nice and long, really comfortable. They fit me nicely around the waist. What size do I get? I've got a size six. Um, and they fit really well. I love styling this kind of thing for now with like a cream oversized jumper and a long wool coat and some trainers to keep it casual. I think they'd look so good with that backless jumper as well and like some nude heels. Again, it's giving kind of like baby shower gender reveal type like neutral pastel kind of colors. Um, but yeah, I really, really love these. Such a great fit. They also come in more of like a beige slash camel color as well if you prefer something like that but really really great quality as always from pretty lavish not see-through at all either which is great and then finally i have a couple of bits from gymshark and um, they very kindly sent me some pieces for a collaboration that we're doing over on instagram so you may have spotted that but i love gymshark i've been wearing their pieces for ever since I started working out at home, so probably like two, three years ago maybe now. And I love the fit, I love the quality, I love everything. So I got some black leggings. These are just some plain black stretchy ones. It's got the little Gymshock logo on the front and they also have a little bit of text on um, the bottom here, which I think is quite cool. But these are so, so comfy. Really good for my Pilates, really good for walking. I can never have too many pairs of black leggings. I literally live in them. I've got a pair on today. Um, yeah, they're just kind of like my go-to when I'm at home around the house or running errands, that kind of thing. Um, and yeah, like I said, these are so good for Pilates. Another thing I got, which I've actually worn to work out in or to do my Pilates in, but um, it's a great basic as well. Gymshark have started to do some really nice, like I think they call like rest day pieces. Um, and I picked up this top, which I adore. Door. it's a really nice like thin jersey material they call it 
they call it some kind of shade of brown on the website but it's more like a khaki kind of beige color um and i love this super thin t-shirt material it's got a little bit of a high neck obviously short sleeved nice tight fitting size did i get it in i got it in a size extra small what did i get the leggings in just before I forget, it doesn't say, but I feel like these are probably an extra small as well. And this is such a nice basic to have. They do lots of different kind of like earthy colours. Um, I've worn this with joggers as well around the house. So, so soft. Really great quality. It kind of reminds me of a top I have from Skims, but it's just a little bit flimsier. But yeah, I really love these pieces. It has a little Gymshark kind of like button on the bottom here as well, but really, really cute. I think it's really nice as well that Gymshark are branching out into not just workout clothes. They've got some everyday casual items as well. I've got a great tracksuit from there as well, which I will probably show you in a vlog. Um, but those are my two bits from Gymshark that I thought I would include in this haul because I've been wearing them so, so much. So that is most of the things that are new in in my wardrobe i really hope you guys enjoyed seeing the new bits that i picked up and my beautiful new jewelry just a reminder of my discount code it's amybeth15 again i'll pop it on the screen and links to everything and my sizes if i remember will be in the description box down below. Don't forget to let me know your favorite piece from the haul. If you did enjoy watching it, it would be so lovely if you could give it a like. If you're new to my channel, please subscribe and I will see you guys all very soon with another video. Bye.